welcome to Tech Checker. Today I'm going to be showing you this MCO Plus MT300G uh, 300 watt milli, mini um, high speed sync slave LCD outdoor flash with a built in 2.4 gigahertz wireless radio receiver um, overheat protection compatible with various cameras so let's have a look so it comes in this really nice hard case so what do we get in the box right so first of all we get a power brick for the flash we get a there a power plug I'll be using a different power plug from this one myself it comes with this one which has not got a built in fuse but I'll just sling that and use one with a fuse in comes with an adapter a tripod mount a wireless receiver transmitter which has a tripod mount as well as a um, standard mount and then the flash itself which is a nice weight to it it's got the flash and the LED built in there let's stick this on like so locks into place we need batteries for this here all right so put some here get them out That's on. Okay, let's back on this. It's magnetic, which is nice. Okay, this has got a, a film on it. I'm having a bit of a job getting off. Flash. Turn the LED light off for a second. So this attaches to that like so. This is so that you can get more flashes faster. So let's just move some of this out of the way. Adapter. I have a. Oh, see, I can use it. Let me just plug it in. I use this plug for the demo, but I'm going to be getting rid of this and using the standard one. So that fits into there like so. Let's move the box out of the way. 
pretty handy that box. So this now plugs into here like so. Which means it should be able to just continuously flash if you need to. And I've got to wait to recharge. And this one uses two AA batteries. Let's get two out of here. Goes in like so. Powered on, so it's channel one. Let's check with this one. This is on channel one. So, yep, that's working. Change the channels, so that's really handy. Let's light this up so you can change the color of this. Let's move it out of the way a minute so it can be green, or white. The quick press to turn the um. LED bulb on. You got manual, sync, TTL, so different and obviously they're all adjustable. Get your mode there. You can adjust the hertz. There's everything you can adjust on this. So this part can be mounted on your camera and it also runs on a USB, it didn't come with a USB lead but you can use a USB to power it as well. Got a sync out there, you got an A, B and C for the channels, you got a transmit and receive and your on off, channel up, channel down, goes to 15 and it is backlit as well so you can use it at night time as well so yeah, lights up that will keep the light on if you lock it okay. some manual now Change that to TTL. And the good thing about this is because it's got the hot shoe here and the hot shoe at the top, once you've mounted this on the camera, you're not actually using a you're not losing any hot shoes. So if you wanted to mount another accessory to this, a speed gun or whatever, um, you still got the hot shoe there to use. So yeah. Really really helpful and the other good thing with this is you can set it to I'll turn my flash gun on here now this is a Sony camera it's obviously not designed to work with that particular flash But I can actually force it to flash. It will link up to the flash on here. And then it will flash through there as well. Change the mood on this one. There we go. Right. So now if I... It's just so that you can see it on the reflection this flashes that flashes as well it's a bit hard to So, put that 
go. So I can have this on manual and it will then work with this one. So if I put this over here, that flashes as well. It's obviously hard for you to see this flashing, but I can have it linked up so that the um, when this one flashes, this will flash as well. So you can have it like a slave setup as well as a dedicated um, flash. There you go. So anyway, hopefully this video has been of some help to you. It's a really nice size. It's a compact. Let's go stand on that. It's a nice compact size. You've got the thread at the bottom which will come out. So you've got the standard size um, tripod thread as well as the bigger one. That looks like it's possibly a little fan to keep it cool. That can be connected onto that. And the great thing with this is if you've got a um, like one of these you don't need your power supply you can plug this directly into here plug it into there lock that in place power that on and now it will take the flash from here and obviously there's no delays if you have it with just the batteries you have to wait whereas if you've got it plugged into this there's no delay it's next to nothing look. even when it beeps it's already got a flash there ready so that's another um, really good thing about this flash so hopefully this video has been of some help to you